Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. I have another product I'm going to be reviewing for you guys today from Minpaw Gourmet Hot Sauce. Now I did review their uh, hot sauce uh, not too long ago and it was fantastic. One of the best tasting products I've had all year. Uh, it definitely made my top uh, 25 list of hot sauces I've reviewed so far this year. But today I'm going to be reviewing uh, the Minpaw Gourmet hot sauce. Now this is the paste or the one that comes in the jar. Let me see if I can get this camera to focus. Yeah, beautiful looking labels on her on her jars and on her bottles. Minpa Gourmet Hot Sauce. And this was sent to me from the owner, Carlene Fenor. And let me go ahead and read a little bit about this. Uh, Minpa is a new natural and organic gourmet hot sauce, a must have in the kitchen and the dining room table. Men Paul will revolutionize the way most individuals eat and cook. And I can attest to that fact because it's true. And uh, they're saying is the orgasmic hot sauce entices you to want more. It's categorized as a specialty sauce. It combines heat and flavor of five different types of exotic peppers, along with the pleasant blend of other seasoning spices in order to distribute a sauce packed with lots of flavor and with heat you would expect from a habanero peppers sauce. All right, now the one I'm gonna be reviewing, now once again, this is the one that comes in the jar. Now Carlene said this is the one that she first started off with. Um, it is uh, all natural. It is um, fresh peppers that are blended together, um, not cooked, but it's more of a fresh paste. You can put it directly on food, but uh, this is a little bit different, tastes a little bit different than the one in the uh, bottle that I, uh, reviewed before. And uh, congratulations uh, to Minpaw Gourmet Hot Sauce because Carlene did win third place in the Scotch Bonnet category for the uh, 2013 Hot Pepper Award. So congratulations on that, uh, Carlene. But uh, let me go ahead and read the side. This is called her Reserve Special, and this is the hot version. And uh, let me go ahead and read the ingredients on this one. Now, I had to write them down because I could I can hardly read this on the side of the jar here. But we start off with chocolate habanero peppers, an olive oil blend, that's with olive oil and canola oil, I believe, apple cider vinegar, scotch bonnet peppers, orange habanero peppers, onions, water, spices, onion powder, sole seasoning. Now that seasoning, complete seasoning and sole seasoning that she has in her uh, hot sauces are just fantastic. Garlic and xanthan gum. So let me go ahead, and I've already used this, uh, prepared something I want to show you guys, but uh, once again, this is a fresh uh, paste. Um, this is stuff is awesome directly on food. I think it's fantastic mixed in with other sauces such as sour cream, mayonnaise as a spread. So there's many different ways you could use this. You could uh, mix it in with a little more oil, put it on your meats, grill them, grilled chicken, grilled shrimp, grilled pork. This stuff tastes good on everything. And uh, this stuff is the bomb because Minpaw means this is it or this is the bomb. And so uh, that's a fantastic uh, title on there. But let me go ahead and show you the, what this looks like, the consistency. It reminds me of a very spicy uh, chili paste or chili sauce. And this stuff is pretty hot too. But let me go ahead and do a little spoon test for you guys. love the it is spicy this stuff is really hot um, I think I gave the uh, original one a 5 out of 10 for heat if I'm not mistaken but uh, this is definitely a strong very strong medium habanero burn um, I'm gonna give this a 6 out of 10 for heat definitely flavor 10 out of 10 this stuff is fantastic um, once again, so versatile, you can use this stuff uh, directly on food or use it in your cooking, use it in your grilling. But what I did today is Carlene sent me a recipe. She, sa she said this stuff would be good on shrimp ceviche. So that's exactly what I've done is I've um, prepared some uh, shrimp ceviche. Now, for those of you who don't know what this is, and I just put this in a nice martini glass for presentation. Um, it could use any type of fish, um, really raw fish or uh, shrimp. I didn't use uh, raw fish. And what you do is because I just couldn't get any real fresh uh, shrimp. Uh, so this, this shrimp is uh, cooked just a little bit. What they do is you mix it up with lime juice 
Uh, there's red onions in here. Uh, there's green bell peppers. There's red bell peppers. And um, according to her recipe, a little bit of uh, olive oil, a little bit of apple cider vinegar, and this men paw uh, sauce is in here as well. I pretty good pretty, put a pretty good amount in here. I also chopped cilantro is in here. Um, but really what makes uh, ceviche taste so good is so fresh, it's so light. Mainly it's the ingredients of um, onions, uh, green peppers, uh, red uh, bell peppers, green bell peppers. You could also put tomatoes in here. You could put cucumbers. You could put avocados. But uh, mainly it's got to have the cilantro and the onions and the lime juice. This has a little bit of freshly squeezed orange uh, juice in it as well. But uh, this stuff is really, really a great way to uh, use this sauce. So I'm going to go ahead and try it out for you guys. What I'm going to do is um, this stuff is good on, on crackers. What I'm going to do is put a little bit here on a tortilla or a um, tostito for you guys. Here, here we go. Let's check this out. Mm. Fantastic. You can use a little bit. You can you can use a lot. I used a little bit more because I really wanted to uh, spice this up a little bit. But this stuff is the bomb. Um, everybody, you got to check this out. She can be located at Menpaw Gourmet Hot Sauce on Facebook. And the website is menpaw, that's M-E-N-P-A-W, hotsauce.com. So make sure you check them out. Highly recommended products, must buys. The stuff is incredible, just fantastic flavor. One of the most unique hot sauces and products that I have ever tasted. So it's really highly recommended. So check it out. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this review. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And until the next time, don't forget... Enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.